Hello. This is the first video I have recorded in 2019. You obviously should know that I didn't record the So It's 2019 video in 2019 because the So It's 2019 video was uploaded at midnight EST. I scheduled it to be uploaded at midnight EST and I recorded it at around 10 p.m. New Year's Eve. This is the first video I've actually recorded in 2019. It, I thought it would be cool to make a sequel. Don't mind the fact that I happen to have the pre-calculus Khan Academy course open. But I, I thought I could make a video about... Um, I thought I could make another brilliant stuff on brilliant video. Which I, I made one of these about um, a year and a half ago. But anyways, let's try this group theory thing. I mean, I have one of those right um, here. This is the GAN 356i. Um, where is my GTS 3M? Longer than I expected to get this way long, but this is the GTS 3M. It actually turns slower than the GAN, GAN 356i, but um, it's worse than the, but it's better than the GAN 356i. And this cube really is. All right. Of H perms, let's do this. Just to make sure we agree on notation, given the cube from the previous problem, what color appears on the top left? Wait, what? Um, the B face. Um, uh, okay. This is the this is the color orientation they had. So, um. B L. Number appears in the top left corner. Green. I am in the seventy-six percent of people that got that right. Forty-eight stickers. I'm not counting the center stickers, which will be fixed. If you move on the cube, corresponds to. Supposed to take your cube apart with a screwdriver. Let's do that, but without the screwdriver. This is my Yushin Low Magic, which is the which is like my most unstable three by three I own. So yeah, um, how many different colored cubies can you make by reassembling the pieces? Differently colored cubes. That. Yeah, I actually know that because um I I just yelled, let's just the other day I watched um <clears throat> Lego Boy Z3's video on how to calculate 43 quintillion. And um you probably notice I have premium now. But the thing is I um I watched that video, okay? And that is act and those are the amount that is actually how you calculate 43 quintillion. At least part of it. You actually just take that number and divide it by 2. Because the, because you see um if once you divide it by two you get the number of possible permutations not just the number of permutations total the number of per we mean the number of permutations that you can count you can get just by turning the puzzle. 
So yeah. I'm gonna try to put this back together later. Okay. Every move in the Rubik's group is therefore described by one is permutation of the twelve edges, two is permutation of the year quarters, three a vector of twelve edge orientations, each with these blah blah blah. Consider the move U and let lowercase sigma and tau be the corresponding elements of S twelve and S eight. What? Did I say theta or did I say sigma? Enough group theory. Let's go to um, a different. The tricalculus fundamentals. Infinite limits. Computing limits two. Start so three squared nine. This is this gives us the indeterminate form zero over zero, which I have defined in my paper to be equal to s. But you know that's my my math um things wouldn't be allowed to. Factor it wants to factor this. I feel like I've actually seen this exact limit before. Let me get my notes. So, page 15 is where we have limits. Let's go back to school to um, um, computing limits one. Compute the limits. So x minus one cubed. So zero cubed equals zero. Yeah. Now um three over one. So x minus one zero cubed divided by one equals zero. And the limit is cosine x as x approaches pi. I'm going to have to get out my trigonometry notes now. <laughs> Page 10. I need to look for the unit circle. So the unit circle is here. So where's pi? Pi be here. Cosine of pi is negative 1. All of them are true. Enough limits. Let's go to derivatives. 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 I said derivatives, okay? Let's find derivatives of trigonometric functions. Um, how are you going to calculate this derivative? Differentiate it somehow. I don't care about trig functions. So the chain, that's the chain rule. Where? Okay. Where is. Oh, product rule, reciprocal rule, and quotient rule. the derivative of that um it's just x e to the x okay undo that um get rid of that okay it was the product rule i forgot to use there mathematical fundamentals crypto 
cryptograms. What does that have to do with math? Mathematical logic, unit rates, arithmetic algebra, arithmetic to algebra. Um, what about um, algebra? Let's do some algebra. So, um, equations and variables. Infinitely many. I mean, the 96% of people who got this right. Which of these equations represents 2x plus y? Um, I, um, I don't see anywhere saying I can't use, I can't use GeoGebra to figure this out. Um... 2x plus y. I think it's gonna be this one, but I am not sh No, this one, this one's. That was for the paper I was talking about, um, about how I tried to define one of our losers. They, they want me to f define um, an implicit function, most likely, so they probably have no idea what I just wrote. Um, Equals five. Equals five. I've run an explicit, fu an implicit function. Check your input. Two x plus y equals five. It's that. Um. Okay. It's d then. I guess. All right. How many solutions satisfy both of the equations? No. Combination flux. Factorials. Factorials. Factory. Fact. 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 Factorials. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. N factorial is greater than b to the nth power. Let's try this. So n factorial, say n equals five. Five factorial equals five times four times three times two times one, which I believe is one hundred twenty. I don't believe it's one hundred twenty. It is one hundred twenty. Now what about um five to the power of five? It's yeah. What did I just? This is why you don't want to have a microphone. Okay. Pop filter removed. You can have it. Wait, what? It just... I'm scared now. Your algebra 2? Logic toy problem solving. Logic 2. Logic circuitry. Notify me. Knowledge and uncertainty. Don't forget infinity. Algebra 1. Algebra 2. Complex numbers. Let's solve some complex number equation. Yes. Turn to this one on calculator. What fraction of this image is red? Mm. B 
is greater. Wait. What? That's lots of logs. That solves the solve this. So log base two of three. Two raised to what power gives you three? I have no clue. Let's just say it's this. It's three. If x is a real number, so let's run the equation. Find the value of x. Zero. But zero is all it works because the like square root of zero plus fifteen is the square root of fifteen. Wait. Never mind. I want to learn about complex numbers, so let me learn about complex numbers. Let me learn about complex numbers because I want to learn about complex numbers. Don't do this. So, um, proof that 1 equals negative 1, 1 equals negative 1, 1. That's not all this formula. That's not all this formula. It's not all this formula. That is Euler's identity. How did only 55% people, 55% of people think that none of these are numbers? Some of these aren't numbers. There. Okay, cool. It's not mystical. What? What is? I want to learn how to do things with complex numbers, not just learn what complex numbers are. It's not a real number. This is what I want. Then what is R is the? Then what is the real part plus the imaginary part? So um. Five point seven plus negative it's three point four. Let's let's just try this. It's negative three. Okay, cool. Mm -mm 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 no, I just wanna stop learning this. Let's try some then else. Let's try algebra two. Inverse functions, compositions, as transformations. Powers and radicals. That's algebra too. Aren't you supposed to learn that in pre-algebra? Radical conjugates, infinite nests, polynomials, playing with factor form, direct and inverse variation, piecewise functions. Aren't you supposed to learn about absolute value in pre-algebra? Like, the majority of these aren't even algebra 2 things. Texania, that's like the worst name for a country ever. Where is the section about logarithms? Is it in here? No, not here, not here, not here. That's the quadratic formula. It's not here. Not there. What? Con
contest math. Here. B to the power of A. I'm going to do this quiz. Just for real number. Solve for B. Yeah, I'm done with this. It's bad. Like, seriously bad.